Due to technical difficulties, the Caribou Show will not be seen this evening. We now switch to our sister station, the Santa Rat Channel. Santa Rat, the Bush Kangaroo. <laughs> Starring Santa Rat and Santa Rat. Sonny Hammond as Sonny. And Sonny Hammond's dad as the Park Ranger. I'm getting ready to go and check on a report of some poachers here in the park. Can I come with? No, Sonny, it might be dangerous. But Santa at the bush kangaroo, would you like to go along? Well, you betcha! I mean... <laughs> <laughs> A great big old trap there, you big dummy! Oh no, Santa Rat the Bush Kangaroo, I'm trapped. Go and get help, boy. Go. Hey, give me the keys. <laughs> Here you go, boy. Uh, bring some help. Because the Santa Rat channel sucks so bad, we're going to try to fix the technical difficulties and get back to the Caribou Show immediately. Welcome to Outside Australia. My name is Skip Beckman. With the success of the Wiggles in Australia and in America, in Canada they're trying to develop their own children's program called The Squiggles. Today we'll be taking a look at The Squiggles and how they produce their show. <laughs>
Greg Squiggle and asked if there were any tensions on the set. Oh, uh, no, there's no kind of tensions on the show as far as I can think of, except that, you know, that or Murray. Oh, man, that is getting all in my way with the dancing. And he, I his mom yesterday, and he, he said, We also spoke with Murray Squiggle to see if he has a different point of view. Murray, do you have a different point of view? You know, I, I love everybody on the show. Oh, we all get along so well, and, and I just love everybody. You know what? Our show sucks. We gotta put up with all those lame ass dancers who think they know what the they're doing. Their mama's titty bitch. That's all I had to say about that. I do it for the kids. God, I love those kids. Those. Their silky white skin and the firm white buttocks. Like boys or girls, I don't care. I just do it for the kids. But Anthony Squiggle has a different angle on the show. Well, let me tell you about it. Murray really is a nice man, I must say. He, he makes it seem like he doesn't love me, but he really does. And I know he does, because he tells me so every night after he hits me. But I deserve it, because I'm not a very good boy. The Squiggles! Will they become as popular as the Wiggles? Only the Canadian public and time will tell. This has been Skip Beckman reporting for Australia and beyond. Ah! Attention washed up child stars. If you used to be known as Beaver Cleaver, Rudy Huxtable, the girl on Elf, any of these people, or the Saved by the Bell girl who did that nudie movie, and you are looking for acting work, look no more. The Caribou Show is looking for washed up child actors to join the cast of the show. Listen to this former child star. Hi, I'm Dan Eisenhower. I used to be a child actor way back more than a year ago. And my career was totally washed up until I joined the Caribou Show, and now my career is only sort of washed up. So if your name appears on this list, or if your career resembles people on this list, apply now. The Caribou Show offers no pay, but they do offer free accommodations free transportation, and all the government cheese you can eat. So why wait? Put your professional acting training to work today on The Caribou Show. Do stuff like this. Or this. Contact The Caribou Show today and get your career out of the gutter and halfway up the curb. We won't be sorry you did. Okay, so it's real simple. Well, okay. We're gonna get on the web. Okay, and then what? Oh. Well, no, I'm telling you how to get on the web. Oh, hurry up. Right, okay, so you, you start, you hold control. Okay. You hit alt. Yep. Alt again. Yeah. Shift, shift. Yeah. Control, shift, shift, alt. <laughs> Windows key, open Apple. Control, reset, reset. <laughs> control. Escape, escape, up, down, up, up, control tab. There we go. We're getting on the web. See, there it comes. Where? Oh! Isn't oh. that easy? Wow! Well, yeah, I'll remember that easy. <laughs> so, uh, well, anyway. Okay, now that we're on the web, pull up a cool website. Oh, a cool website? Yeah. This one isn't cool enough? No, this one sucks. Yeah, all right. <laughs> Ooh! Ooh! Clone hey. aid? Clone Kool Aid. <laughs> Print that up for me. Okay. There, it's printing. <laughs> Well, here we are in the lobby. Yeah, we got a kick-ass lobby. Yeah! 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 Yeah!
show to start. Oh, all right. Yeah. yeah. Get I got Come on, Dan. Get it tuned in there. Here we go. Hey, I heard those clones have a show on PBS the same time ours is on. Hey, let's watch their show. Let's watch yeah. Show. Yeah. I've already seen all ours. Right. Put it yeah. on PBS. Yeah, all, right. Yeah. all right. Here we go. <laughs> Hi. Welcome to the Moose Show. I am tonight's moderator, Dick Moose. <laughs> We're trying to find out a way to make the world a better place. And before the show started, we had our panelists think of a way to come up with to try to make the world better. And we're going to start with Joe. Well, Dick, I've come up with a surefire way to cure cancer. And we've seen it on TV with that barefoot guy. It's Coral Calcium. And Mr. Hinder, what did you come up with? Well, Mr. Moose, I've come up with a surefire method to solve the starvation problem in Ethiopia. And the way we'll feed the kids in Ethiopia is through coral calcium. And Mark, what have you come up with to try to make the world a better place? Well, Dick, I'm going to promote world peace by reducing the world's pollution with coral calcium. And now, finally, here. Well, Dick, I thought that I would solve the problem of homosexuality by the use of coral calcium. And I, Dick Moose, have come up with a way to get rid of that burning, painful itch of hemorrhoids through coral calcium. Hey, doesn't their set look a lot like our lobby? Yeah, but that's not the worst part. What, you mean because if they do all that good stuff, they'll end up being more important than us? No, because their show's audio and exposure sucks. <laughs> yeah. 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 They, they suck. They yeah, sure boom. do. Let, let's watch our own show. Yeah, turn the channel. Yeah. Yep. Do that again. <laughs> yeah. Welcome, everybody, to the Caribou Show. We're going to do something today on the Caribou Show that's going to make the world a better place. And you're probably thinking to yourself, what could those guys do to make the world a better place? Well, I tell you what, we're going to moon some celebrities. That's right, because showing celebrities our asses is a great thing to do. All right, well, who should we moon? I know. How about Barbara Streisand? Okay. <laughs> hey, there's Chillas in Rock Rapids, Iowa. Oh. Let's go! Yay! This is it. Right. Ready? Let's do it. Ready? Two, two, three. Yeah! What the hell are you guys doing? I'm not Barbara Streisand. I'm Bert Stensland. Whoops. Hey, you gotta do something to get these clothes off the air. Yeah, because the quality of the caribou show sure ain't going to do it. 
Hey, I got an idea. Let's go out and find those guys and whack them. Oh, yeah, that's a, that's a good idea, but you know, we should get the UN Security Council to make sure that's okay. That's oh, right. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Come on, let's go get them. Hey! 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 We got a kick-ass lobby. Yeah! yeah! That's right, that clone we got, that, that worked pretty good. Yeah, really yeah. good. Can't believe I got it at the dollar store. <laughs> you know, I'm thinking, you know, all those clones, they thought they were pretty good stuff, but uh, I think there's more to them than we think. They might even have weapons of mass destruction on them. <laughs> let's go check out, oh, come on. Well, well, let's see what they got here. Wow, look at all that's left of them is their shirts. Wow. Hey, what's this stick for? I don't know. Hey, look it. Look what I found. What's this? It says, secret plan to tell everyone we solved all the world's problems with coral calcium, but we really want to eat everyone like like on the old NBC miniseries, B. Oh, man. Secret plans. You know, Dan wasn't even born when that show was on, I bet you. Probably. Man. Well, you know what that proves? That. We were the good guys again. We did it. Mommy, I'm bored. I want a daddy. Honey, I know things are difficult, but I just don't know what to do. Mommy, the man on TV said use this. Chicken on a rope? Okay, let's try it. Well, come on. Gee, honey, you're right. That was terrific. I wonder who that is. Hello? A date? Sure, I'd love to. 